Okay, thank you. My name is Hector, Hector Becerril, and I work for the National Council of Science and Technology in Mexico. Um, the main message that I want to, to share with you is that uh, small and medium-sized cities uh, uh, entail specific challenges for mainstreaming disaster, disaster re risk reduction in planning. I also argue that the concept of co-production might be useful to address those challenges. As a background, I want to say that I completed my PhD two years ago and I started working and I was commissioned to conduct research in the metropolitan area of Acapulco. This metropolitan area is, a, is what we can consider as a medium-sized settlement almost reaching one million inhabitants. The research program that I was uh, commissioned to sought to generate knowledge about risk and urban development in this area, but also to influence public policy. The research pro pro program, as, as you know, was aligned with the different international agendas, just, such as the Sendai framework and the new urban agenda. However, the implementation of the project faced important challenges. I'm mentioning two of them, the most important. The first one is the literal understanding of policymaking processes and governance of this type of, 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 of Acapulco. And this is much related to the fact that urban planning and all the, most of the literature focus on the largest cities in Mexico, meaning Mexico City, Guadalajara, and Monterrey. The second major uh, obstacle were the weak capacities, not only from the public sector to develop policies, but also from the civil society, as uh, it was mentioned before, they were associated underlying uh, factors such as ex poverty and extreme poverty. In addition to that, you have a really weak academic sector. So therefore, the challenge here in, this, in, this, in the case of Acapulco and the metropolitan area was how to mainstream disaster risk reduction in a context mar uh, marked by a uh, little understanding of what was happening, the gap on, on knowledge, and secondly, weak capacity of all actors, including the academic sector. As a tentative response, we have been developing in, 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 in Acapulco a project since, since February uh, on climate risk. And the, the project is linked to a regional uh, initiative for climate uh, risk reduction in Latin America. And what I'm talking about, talk here is about the, the concept of co-production that is uh, the, the cornerstone of this project. Uh, the concept of co-production is understood here and stresses that science and society are produced at the same time and influence each other. However, they are not the same. Based on this understanding, the project aims to build towards moving towards social aims, but also to, towards a building capacity of the scientific sector, in particular the local academic sector in, in Acapulco. Therefore, the project focus on the, ones, on, on, the, on the production of knowledge and building of capacities of all actors, including the academic sector. And I will mention at the end, uh, as a concluding remark, that the mainstreaming of disaster risk reduction in these small and medium-sized cities should include the production of different knowledge, including scientific knowledge, and also the capacity of uh, the building of the building capacity of all actors, including the academic sector. Thank you very much. Okay.